Well, as you can tell, we're enjoying the as you can tell, we're enjoying the campfire tonight, and we're trying to let it die down before we hit the bed. Behind us, we've got our tent set up, all our night gear is on, so we're ready to go. Um, we're just taking it easy, enjoying the company and the serenity of the Yellowstone. And uh, so we have to wait for the fire to die before we can go to bed because we can't leave the fire unattended. But uh, obviously, you can tell it's starting to die because it got very dark all of a sudden. But you'll see it light up very quickly soon here shortly. Yeah, so it's uh, it's rather cloudy tonight, so unfortunately we're not getting any stars. But we did see the moon briefly, and so there are a few... Is pointing out at some point. Yeah. So there's no light pollution. It's completely dark, except for the uh, fellow campers that are around us, which there are several dozen. There's, there's lots of them. But uh, you still feel kind of alone in your own campsite, which is a good feeling. It's a nice, pleasant feeling. Yes. So, so we've been enjoying some music and some good company as we've been taking an easy evening and we'll get ready for tomorrow and I'm in charge of breakfast which is going to be thrown together. Yeah, won't be as good as the dinner I'm sure. No. But so. uh, tomorrow's our last day in Yellowstone. We head back to Cody for the night then the following morning we're off to the Little Bighorn and then from there to Mount Rushmore. So we'll be hitting the hay here soon. Hopefully we'll be early to bed, early to rise, as they say. Till next time. Until next time. <laughs>